And now, welcome back to Helpful Hints. And today we're talking about vampires. Who has the time to go rummaging around for that old vampire hunting kit? Today, we're going to show you all sorts of ordinary household items that can be used to protect yourself against vampires. What do you folks think? <laughs> now folks, you may not have cloves of garlic just laying around, but what you might have is... Garlic powder! Ooh, garlic powder! That's right, garlic powder. If you were to take just a little of the garlic powder, dab it on your hand, and... Oh, yeah! You see, folks? That certainly stopped me in my tracks. It may not kill a vampire, but it'll give you the time you need to escape. Who in the audience loves Asian cuisine? Who doesn't love Asian cuisine? Next time you're out to dinner with your family, go ahead and ask for an extra pair of chopsticks. Chopsticks? Whoa, what are you going to do with those? Eat the vampire? <laughs> You've all heard of using big wooden stakes, but who's got space to carry around a ginormous piece of wood? I sure don't. <laughs> all you're going to want to do is take them and drive them directly into the chest of the vampire. Whoa, that sure is effective. Now, folks, this isn't going to kill the vampire, but it is going to slow him down. Well, certainly none of you just has silver bullets laying around, but what you may have is the silver bullet. Oh. That's not the kind of silver bullet I'm used to seeing. Unless your vampire is a social drinker, what you're going to want to do as they approach is shake up the silver bullet and... Whoa! And it's a much more humane way of shooting your vampire with the silver bullet. That's a silver bullet I wouldn't want to get in the way of. Now, you folks have heard of direct sunlight harming or even killing vampires, right? Ultraviolet radiation is one of the best known vampire killers, but how is that going to help you in the middle of the night? Spray tan. Spray tan? That's right, folks. You probably have some at home, and ladies, you might even have some in your purse. All you're going to want to do is take the spray tan and aim it at that vampire. It's going to do the rest of the work for you. At the end of it, the vampire is going to have a nice bronze complexion, and you're going to have enough time to escape. Who knew that spray tan could save your life? Next time on Helpful Hints, Gargoyles! <laughs>